from performance boosters that squeeze every drop of power out of your hardware to stunning customization options that personalize your gaming experience. We have got you covered. How's it going guys, Tech here. And in this video, I'm going to show you some of the most essential softwares to get when you set up a gaming PC. So this is my good old 2021 ROG Strix Car 15 with RTX 3080. So I installed some softwares and guide you to why you need to have them on your PC. So let's get right into it. By the way, this is not a sponsored video and whatever I'm going to tell you will be out of my sheer knowledge and experience and all the softwares are free to use. So first, I suggest you to install Armory Crate since this is the official way of controlling and monitoring your fans, RGB effects, overclocking, etc. For Asus gaming laptops, you can get Armory Crate from the official website. By the way, I'll link all the softwares below the like button. So next up is WinRAR. So it's a utility software that helps you suppress or decompress various files. So if you buy it a game, you're gonna need this to properly access those downloaded files. And next is AMD Software Installer. So this is provided for AMD users, which will basically help you update your drivers and softwares, mostly graphic card and processors. This software is called GeForce Experience. It focuses only on installing and updating to latest NVIDIA graphic drivers and optimizing your games. So this is basically for NVIDIA graphic card users. It also gives you a shortcut access to record gameplays and stream online by connecting it to a platform you want. It also has a quick monitoring for your system for displaying current FPS, GPU temperature and other stats. You can also manage your game library and optimize game and quick launch them. Well, everyone knows about Discord and what this application does. I wonder if I even need to explain why you need this. But for the starters, this is basically the best voice and video chat software for gaming. You can create your own community with voice channels for different games or activities and stay organized with various controls and you can also integrate bots inside voice channels that does certain tasks like playing music etc and you can hang out with your buddies and just chill when not in the mood of gaming overall it's a must this is msi afterburner and river tuner well well this is where things actually get real this is a utility software provided by msi for detailed overclocking of your pc that requires proper knowledge obviously and with Afterburner comes River Tuner, another software that works with it for monitoring stats on your display like GPU temperature, average minimum and maximum frames, fan speed, RAM usage, CPU usage and it even shows all the CPU usage like if you have 16 CPUs like 16 cores or something, it will show usage of every single one of them and like obviously it is very accurate. So you can monitor your performance with super ease. And there is also a hardware monitor that shows as a graph the more accurate details. And I recommend this one to everybody for proper monitoring. I guess quite enough with overclocking and monitoring, right? OBS Studio software is the best out there for recording and live streaming games on different platforms. The feature list is unbelievable. From filters, transition, customizable interface to live streaming on multiple platforms at the same time, even going live is possible. And there's only one catch, that is, when you use this software for the very first time, you may find it quite complex, which it is, but you can learn it in no time, that's the beauty of it. So this next one is really amazing, it is made by Razer, and then again two softwares, Razer Cortex and Razer Axon. By the way, anyone can use it, you don't need to have a Razer setup for this, but you may need it for setting up RGB effects for Razer devices like headphones, keyboards, mouses, etc. So Cortex is where you can manage your whole game library but more than that, you get to boost your games by optimizing many things that may use power in the background and you can even clean your PC like removing junk files and not only this, it also provides performance task monitor which is easy to use. The next one is Razer Axin. So this software helps you create AI generated wallpapers and have RGB lighting effects settings. Then again, like I said earlier, you may need Razer accessories to make custom RGB palette. But for the AI part, anybody can use this. Well, if you do make AI generated photos, you can make it here. But the catch is, you can only do it 10 times for free, then you will have to purchase extra tokens from Razer, I guess. And from what I have generated, I don't think it's too good or maybe, I might need some more specification, like I need to specify the requirements more properly. I don't know, 
but you may know. So there it is guys, I may have missed some good softwares, I'll try to cover them in next video. Until then, thanks for watching, so long.